grandma who just wants to go to the kitchen and bake some cookies in this. She's thriving right now. We're letting those back rolls just hang, girl. Let them hang. Let them hang. I got a little bit of a wedgie. I got it out. Hey guys, and welcome back to my channel. My name is Sierra. If you are new here, I like to post fashion related content, specifically plus size fashion. So if that's something you like, definitely subscribe down below. And let's be besties. All my besties are subscribed to my YouTube channel. Today we are going to review a brand that I'm sure you have heard of. If you haven't heard of this brand, you're probably living under a rock. No, I'm kidding, but they are a newer brand, but they have been all over social media it is cider cider has lots of cute trendy clothes like those clothes that you see all over Pinterest the cute girly prints the colorful sweater vest all of that is probably found on cider I love the style of cider one thing I've always wondered are they plus size friendly cuz I mean yeah you can make some clothes cute trendy but i only ever see them for small girls i really want to try out some of those styles so today we have some clothes that we will be trying out from cider that are the cute trendy pinterest girl clothes that i never see in my size and we're gonna see will they fit someone with my body also you guys are probably wondering like how long did it take to get your order i'm gonna be honest sorry cider i did not have high hopes in you guys I thought it was going to take forever, but when I tell you guys, that thing came so quick. It was on my doorstep. Like, what? Let me check the dates. So I ordered the clothes March 28th, and the tracking says that they arrived 4-4. <laughs> so I ordered 3-28. They came 4-4. That's... That is only seven days that it took for these clothes to arrive. Keep in mind, the mail doesn't run on the weekends. I probably could have gotten it sooner, but that is on a Monday that they came in. Yeah, I definitely think the delivery was super quick compared to what I was expecting. Now let's see if these clothes actually fit me. We'll, we'll, we'll see. Also, hold on. Gotta tell y'all something. I typically do my try on hauls in shapewear, which I realize is kind of unfair because natural bodies are not the same as they would be in shapewear. And I don't wanna wear shapewear everywhere I go and I don't wanna be crushed and not being able to breathe. So I thought I would do the try on without shapewear. And most of my try ons for future reference are probably gonna be without shapewear. Let's try on some clothes. Y'all see this? Y'all see? You don't understand, I'm obsessed. These pants, I mostly just ordered the pants with no expectations at all that they were gonna fit. I have a big tummy, like a big tummy. Most jeans or pants don't fit me, especially when they run like 1X, 2X, 3X. These are in a 4X. I expected a 4X to be maybe a size 18. I'm a size 22 in pants. And these fit me with extra room to spare. Like they, they have a little bit of stretch in them. I mostly just ordered this as like, not really a joke, but oh, I'll get it to try it out. But I really don't think this is gonna fit at all. These are good quality too. I'm, I'm just shook. The bottom does have a little bit of a flare. I don't know, can you guys see? The bottom is flared. It does have belt loops. The back pockets are kind of like those business pants pockets. But I love these pants. And this shirt, this shirt is chef's kiss. I'm gonna give you guys my honest opinion. If something, if I don't like something, I'm not gonna lie and say that I like it. I'm being 100% honest and I'm honestly shook by the quality and the fit of these clothes. With this top, I'm actually braless because it is backless which I'm kind of excited to wear for summer. I have been insecure during the summer before, but this summer I'm not gonna be insecure. No insecurities this summer. We're letting those back rolls just hang, girl. Let them hang, let them hang. But I love this lime green color. This is like my favorite color. I'm sorry if y'all see my boobs a little bit, but yeah, this is a shirt that you can't wear a bra with. 
maybe a bathing suit top underneath if you're at the beach or something but other than that I just go braless I love the collar it's like a sweater material and it's really good material like the fuzz isn't coming off or anything probably gonna be one of my favorite summer tops I've already posted some things on Instagram in this top it's definitely gonna be my favorite this summer the only thing I could ask for with this shirt would be to go a little longer it's kind of the length of like a sports bra. I kind of like my crop tops to go a little longer. So when I'm wearing them with pants, like my whole stomach is an ounce. Other than that, I love this full outfit. It's a look. Someone on Instagram told me it's giving Shaggy from Scooby-Doo vibes and I simply can't unsee it. Guys, this is my style. Like, look at this. This is so cute. I love this. It's the perfect length. The material is amazing. It's kind of like that soft sweater material. It's super stretchy. Everything I got is in a size 4X. This could easily fit someone a larger size than me. Like, look at this stretch. I love this. I know it's not like anything too crazy, but I have been looking for a sweater vest that fits me like this. I have one and it like is cropped on me. I like cropped things, but sometimes you just want a full sized top and this is perfect. This haul is definitely going better than I expected. I expected this one to be a good piece. I wasn't sure on the quality, but so far, Cider has exceeded my expectations. I love this. And with these pants, I think it's a look. What do you guys think? The cool part about it is it's sleeveless, so I could even see myself wearing this during the summer. Most people are not wearing sweater vests in the summer, but the way that this material is, I easily see myself wearing this during the summertime. Okay, what do you think? Do we like it? Do we not? If you guys have seen any of my other videos, you would know how I feel about body contouring things. When I got this, I knew it was gonna be bodycon, but I don't think I actually thought it through. This is a super cute dress, don't get me wrong. I love the print, the material is amazing. Like it's so stretchy. It's just like the material, I wouldn't say it's the exact same as that sweater vest, but it's very close. It's kind of like a knit material. This one doesn't have fuzz on it, but it is very soft. This feels amazing, but I think it's just my own insecurities when it comes to body contouring things. Like my whole belly is out and I wanna be more comfortable in things like this. For me, it's not my favorite. I think if you're, um, I think if you're more comfortable with your body, you would love this dress. Or if you're more of like an hourglass shape. Now, I do not care about flattering. Don't get me wrong, I do not care about flattering. But I think I need to give it some more time before I try something like this. I just got over my insecurity of wearing like sleeveless things, but this is a little much for me. All of my insecurities show, but I love this dress. I think I might just like wear it around the house, maybe try to become more comfortable in the dress before I wear it out. If that makes sense, it's so soft. And look at this print, this print is adorable. Also, I'm only wearing a sports bra because I can't be bothered to put on an actual shaping bra. If the girls look a little flat, it's cause they are. <laughs> it's also very short, like y'all see this length? I feel like my whole areas is gonna be showing to everybody. I got a little bit of a wedgie. I got it out. So, you know I had to have one piece that was just not perfect. This is that piece. I have seen everyone and their moms wearing this dress. I thought this dress was gonna be the perfect dress. I thought it was gonna be my dream dress. I always have wanted like a little princess looking dress for a good affordable price because they are affordable compared to other brands. But now this may be on me. Don't blame Cider, but as you can see, I'm holding something back here. The zipper broke. Y'all see that? The zipper broke. So yeah, I can't zip it up. I don't know if it's my fault. When I put it on, the zipper just like broke or if it's their quality. Um, it could definitely be my fault. So I'm not gonna put them to blame. But I think even if the zipper was still on, 
it would fit me very tightly. Like these arms are kind of squeezing. The dress itself doesn't have any stretch. It does have shorts underneath the dress. The shorts underneath the dress are actually really stretchy. The dress itself doesn't have much stretch, not in the waist or anything. So even if the zipper didn't break, I think it probably wouldn't have fit me anyways. Maybe I'll try to get someone to repair the zipper for me, but for now it's unwearable and everything I did get in a size 4X. Other than that, the quality is amazing. Like. It is a really good dress. It's adorable. I love the little corset in the front. I'll definitely include a photo over here so you guys can see what it should have looked like. But I think someone could definitely repair it. It's an adorable dress. I love how they make their shirts in this material. Like pretty much all the shirts that I got have been in this sweater material and I really love that because I hate the feel of normal just t-shirts. I don't wear many t-shirts, just plain t-shirts. So I love that all of their things are in this silky soft sweater style material, but it's still very breathable and you won't get super hot. I thought this shirt was the cutest shirt ever. One thing I will mention the arms are kind of tight. It is kind of uncomfortable. I mean, it's bearable, but it's uncomfortable. The other tops that I tried on that were similar to this one were not like this. So I think that there's, this This does fit a little smaller, although it's the same size. So I do see a little bit of a size inconsistency in the tops, not a huge one. Other than that, I definitely love this top. It's like a little cropped, funky. It looks kind of retro. It gives me retro vibes. The buttons are actually fake. They don't actually unbutton. As for this skirt, eh, it kind of just makes me look like a blob. Maybe I should have sized down. I don't know. I, I think it's cute when it's like this and open, but when it's like this, it's just not cute to me. I have tried like rolling it up and I think it looks a little better. Yeah, I don't know. Now it kind of looks weird on top when I roll it inwards, but I just wish it would like flare out. I think it would be adorable if it flared out a little more like this, but it just goes back closed. I'm probably not gonna wear it if it stays like this. If it was a little shorter too, like maybe if you got rid of this area and just had the flare and made it a little wider. As is, it's just not my cup of tea. I love skirts. This is nowhere near my favorite. Maybe it's a little too big, I don't know. And we're back with the OG pants because I love these pants. These are probably gonna become my favorite pants. This next one is like a winter sweater. It is thicker than all the other sweaters. It's long sleeves, amazing quality again. I love the funky fall time colors and print on the front. They go perfectly with these pants. My only complaint about this top is the amount of crop. I feel like I wish it came down a little longer because when I'm just like going free, you know, my whole stomach is out. Raise your arms, you better be wearing a sports bra or something underneath because your tibby's gonna fall out. Did I just call them tibbies? Yes. Other than that, I love this sweater. It's adorable. I just wish it was longer. Sometimes I just don't wanna show my full stomach in public. Maybe just a little, just leave them guessing. I mean, they're not gonna guess whether or not I'm fat because I mean, you can see that without my stomach showing, but you don't need to see everything. But I still see myself wearing this. It's so cute. Maybe with like a high rise skirt that goes up here. That would look so bomb. I look like a girl going to like a little coffee shop or something. Give me some scenarios for these outfits. Like where, where should I wear them? The inner grandma who just wants to go to the kitchen and bake some cookies in this. She's thriving right now. This is so cute. I look like someone's grandma. I really do, but in the best way possible. This shirt, it'll fit someone bigger than me. The arms, they're so comfortable. They actually go down a little longer, which I really like. Look at all the room in this shirt. 
Same quality as the other sweater, just a lot bigger, a lot roomier, which I really like. I like to have space. The crop on this is perfect. It goes right to the top of my pants. They're not going to see my boobs in public. Might see a little belly if I'm looking for something on the top shelf, but that's okay. And the details on this is so cute. Like it has heart buttons all down the front. Buttons aren't like real. You can't unbutton it. But I mean, who's going to be walking around with their shirt unbuttoned? You can just slip it off very easily. Another one of my favorites. Y'all, I cannot wear these pants out of the house. Last item, I'm going to show you guys kind of what I mean. My sister down there, she's, she's kind of showing. Mm, mm -mm. I love this top, but the pants, they have absolutely no stretch. They're like that sheer material, but not stretchy, kind of like a scarf. Uh, my tummy's like busting out. They're see-through. These aren't going to work out. Um, I wish they fit like those pants. I wish they had some stretch and I wish I didn't have a camel toe. I'm just going to show you guys how this top looks though. I love it. It's kind of like that green one in the beginning. You have to go braless with it. This one's more of that fuzzy kind of sweater. It has hair, but it's not itchy. It has a high neckline and an open back. I love the color. I just knew that these were going to look so good together and they would have if these pants weren't going into my, my cooch. And the way you put it on, there's a zipper on the side. So you might need some help from someone or just zip it and then pull it up. Okay guys, so that's all the clothes that I got to try on today. My overall opinion, the majority of the clothes did fit. I love how they looked. I can definitely see myself wearing them in the future. So I would... I'd say that they are probably plus size friendly. Their clothes work on someone with my body type. So I guess that makes them plus size friendly. Thank you guys all for watching until the end of the video. If there's another brand that you guys would like me to try out, then definitely comment the name of them down below. Don't forget to subscribe down below. And if you would like, you can definitely follow Cider. I will link their socials down below. If you do end up purchasing something from their website, definitely use my discount code. I will put it here on the screen. Thank you guys so much for watching. See you guys next time. Bye!